Welcome back to Shardy's World. I'm Shardy. So, I was supposed to have been have this video out. My apologies. I got a little busy. But, I'm going to be telling you about my second, third, and fourth week. I'm going into my fifth week tomorrow. And we're going to be learning men's cuts. So, I'm very excited because that's the skill I want to have. So, I'm going to be going to barber school after this. And makeup school. So, I'm excited for the future but let me tell y'all about my second third fourth week so let me just hop right into this I met Scott Cole the owner of my school he was amazing he gave a lot of good tips and when he was there he actually really he just took the time to help each of us individually he walked around and just was very helpful so and he gave us his story but aside from that we learned about perms and relaxers, which personally for me, I thought my whole life I've been getting perms, which isn't true. I was getting relaxers. That's what my teacher told me. She's very helpful. <laughs> but these are actually perms. And the different types of perms is acid, which is for highlighted, tinted, or fine hair. And it's usually 15 minutes. Exothermic, which heats up in usually 25 to 30 minutes, and then it's alkaline wave with four coarse hair. So those are different types of perms. So something I also learned is sectioning. You need to know how to section hair or your hairstyle won't turn out properly. So we we really section every day. Um, and I've gotten better with with it I feel like personally it's really hard to it's it's difficult to section on mannequins because they their hair just, just I don't know but when I try on other people it's really easy for me so but that's just for me um let's see look I'm looking at stuff so excuse if I keep looking down but um Spa week, which I love. We learned about nails. We did water manicures, which I love. Is basically what I begin, which I need one. I'm gonna give myself one later. But we did. We learned how to build a nail. So, and that's what I'm really gonna be getting into um, acrylics. So we learned about facials. So I'm gonna butcher all these words. So I'm sorry, but. Etheridge is like stroking, so this is how you do it. And we gave facials on each other, which is all up like this. Or I think they stroke in, but I like stroke out, but whatever. Pesterage, which is a neat moment, and it's really for right here, and you just for your little cheeks, so it's like this. <laughs> so, right there. And you do these movement, the movements three times each. Then friction. It was just your fingers and palms. And you just like, you do some deep rubbing into your skin. Just really all up. So, and you don't go past the shoulders. Because if you do, that's more of a massage person. So, we don't do that. So, we do tapplement, Which is... Um, quickly tapping and slapping, not really slapping yourself, but, or the other person, but, like that, like tapping. So, and then vibration, which is, <laughs> did y'all remember, like, <laughs> it used to be this, um, thing when I was younger, where they'd be like, come on, go faster, eh, y'all don't know what I'm talking about, but, it was like a motorcycle and she would get chubby and then go on pack. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. Every Wednesday we have powwows and we were talking about fundraisers. They're having fundraisers now. We're going to have the prom. We're doing, we're supposed to be, like, get a person or a mannequin and we do a nice prom hairstyle. And we can, we might can win prizes. So that's 
that's nice. Uh, Salon Centric is a place for professional hairstyles, hairstylists, and we went there and we just signed up for it. And now we get like coupons. They like they always send me stuff to my email, and it's just for professionals. And it's really they really have some nice stuff. Okay, so they had graduate last week or the week before last, and they everybody was crying. Even my class was like, "Oh my God, y'all stop crying!" Because I'm sensitive. I didn't I, I didn't cry because basically I didn't know anybody there who was graduating. But I definitely felt them. Like, when I graduate, I'm trying not to, I hope I don't cry. But I might cry, y'all. Especially if all the other girls start tearing up. I'm going to be crying. Because <laughs> I'm going to go through that whole year with them. Ugh, I'm going to be crying. Okay, so fourth weeks. Fourth weeks was cut, y'all. We were cutting every single day the whole seven to seven and i feel like i got much better like we learned it's square graduation round graduation triangle graduation which graduation is a build-up we learn layers which takes away weight i like my sunnies with a cherry on top make that ass drop Okay, so round is longer in longer in the back and shorter in the front. Triangle is shorter in the back, like shortest in the back, and then long in the front. You see those haircuts, they're cute, like bobs. Square is balanced. Um, we learned how to palm it, so we do we do this also in the morning, like. Which is cool. It's. I just went through that fast, y'all, but it wasn't fast. It was very detailed, and we had a lot of special guests. We're going to. I forget her name, but she's coming in to help us on Thursday do our men's cuts. And everybody there is really. Like, I haven't met anybody. I'm, I've seen all the instructors, and. Like, even when I was reading online that, like, they were not educated and some of them were mean. I, I haven't met a mean person yet. there yet. They're all nice. And if they're mean, they probably had a bad day. But I haven't got any of that. And even my teacher, like, her leg was hurting, but she was still walking around helping people. And she said, she, like, she's seasoned. And she's just, she's probably like, I don't She's probably, I'm 5'9", y'all. I feel like she's probably 4 feet. And she is just a ball of energy. I love her. She is so helpful because I literally call her name. But I'm like, it's just, uh, please, one more time. Didn't get that. I know you just spent 30 minutes telling us that, but can you tell me again? And she's just like, of course. Thank you. Okay, let's do it. Uh, so I really, really do like her. So we, for April 25th is our graduation day out of core, what we're basically doing to get out onto the floor where everybody else is. And we have to have two models, a male model and a female model. The female model is my mother. Her hair is probably like here and I'm going to be cutting it. Then we need a male model to do um, a cut one. So I'm still finding my male model. But we also have to know, like, this diagram. She says a lot of people, this is where most points get taken out of. So I've been studying this because I own 100 on it. And I honestly, I want to know, like, when I get out there, I don't want to have to keep flipping to the front to figure out what each line means. So I've really been... And this is for the men's cuts, but see, it's really every style. Like, the I'd probably have somebody on Thursday when um, our instructor is telling us, or showing us, teaching us how to do men's cuts. So, but one, I think he said he wanted a fade, so he'd probably 
he probably wants to this. And it just gives you step by step how to do everything. So you don't, you can still, you're, you're supposed to still ask your instructor, but so you can just like read it. Like it tells you ever, like it tells you step by step how to do everything. So I really didn't just reading everything. Like I went to know how to straighten my hair. I just read it and then I did it. And I thought it came out good. I gave myself a deep condition. Great. I used their tea tree products, which I personally love because I love the smell of it. And it's just wonderful. Like, I love the school I picked. Like, everybody keeps commenting that they don't know which school they should go to. But honestly, why I picked Paul Mitchell is because, well, when I did my research on him and I also visited them plus the other schools but really what sold me is I already knew what I was coming in there to do I want to go I want to be on film I don't really want to work in the salon even though I'm probably going to work while I'm in school but I don't want to do that I don't want to be in the salon the whole time you know so I know what I wanted and they have connections to them to that like what is it called um the the the, the I'm sorry, <laughs> the design team, and they literally always, like, they're going to have a PMAC show, which I'm going to, it's about makeup, and they have makeup classes and everything, y'all should check it out, I'll link it below, it's only, it's $150, but I think it's well worth it, like, one of my teachers from my school is going to be there instructing, they have free classes, and they also have paid classes, which is only $100 for eyelash extensions, I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> but well, let me get back on track but where was I going with that they were okay so oh yeah so the design team they have a lot of they always go to like fashion shows like my school did um my favorite movie what is it called I'm having brain faults Okay, so my favorite movie, The Hummingbird, Mockingbird, The Humming Mockingbird, uh, with the girl, shit, sorry, <laughs> I don't remember, but they do back, they do hair on set, they've done it before, they did, they do it for fashion shows and everything, and that's just really what I want, even though I don't want to do fashion shows, but I feel like the high pace is what I need to get into, because that's what they're going to want on set. So I'm definitely going to be on the design team. And they're having a career fair. And I talked to, but I don't remember her name, but she's one of like the high ups there. And I talked to her and she was, she just came in to talk to our class um, last week. And she was just going, telling us all the opportunities we have and what's coming to the school. And she was like, it's a career fair where all salons come here and you get to meet them and see what salon you like and I'm still gonna go because I want to have a job now but I also asked her I was like so can you get you know television and film to come here and for like like salons are and she said not this time but she said she's going to actually reach out to see if they can so you just have to talk to people but that's why I picked Paul Mitchell. If you really want color, I don't know, I still say Paul Mitchell. But it, it just depends on what you want. Like, a lot of people do like um, Aveda. And I I like them, too. Like, they seem really professional, like, for real. So it just depends on what you want. You just need to sit there and I take some time out and think. Like, okay, so what do I want? I want a game. Make you a vision board so you know what you want. And just do it. Stick it out. Finish to your strong. And really, I, I feel like I'm lucky because everybody in my class is very, they're very, they're high spirit to people. Like, I, they're, we don't have drama in our class and I love that because I don't have time for drama 
I'm not a drama person. I'm really, <laughs> people say I'm quiet, but I'm just, I'm laid back. Uh, I don't really care. I came here for, to do this. I don't have to make friends. It's very, it's a perk, but I'm here to do what I need to do so I can go out and travel the world like I want to. So just really focus on you. Know what you want to do. Don't really listen to other people. Just do what you know it's right for you. But that's all I have to say. Thank y'all for watching my video. Now I'm about to go watch my friend play, you know, basketball during their finals. So, um, I'll see y'all next time. If you want, give me tips on like what my next videos should be, what you want to see. Uh, yeah. Sign it off.